So I found a path. And we are in the Grand Canyon again, by the way. See? So nice. But it's rather late in the day. It's like five. It took forever to get to the northern part of the Grand Canyon, which is where I've been driving today. But I found this nice path that goes sort of into a canyon. I don't I don't think it goes very far, but I found a trail at least. It rained again. It's been raining every day I've been in Arizona. So much rain. But it's good, you know what? I'm good. It is very cold also. It is very cold up here. It was not this cold before. It was cold in, what, is that two days ago when I visited the Grand Canyon, but did not expect it to be this cold. Oh. Oh, we found stairs. Oh, they lead to somewhere cool, I think. Oh, they're very, oh, very jagged stairs. Okay, down we go. Oh, so many, so many holes of water. Look at all that. Okay, and then we step around, around, and look. here. I'm not sure what else we'll do at the Grand Canyon. I was gonna go to Zion National Park today too, but I don't think I'll have time. I mean, the sun's already setting. I don't want to be walking around in parks at night. It's dangerous. And I already get lost enough during the daytime, so... That's cool. Look at that root. Just wants to be in the rock. Power on. You can do it. Uh, but yeah. I don't know what else we'll do today. <laughs> I was thinking I would get to the park by like 2 or 3. It's 5. Whatever. It's no big deal. Just... Yeah. <laughs> Oh, spiky tree. Looks like something that would be used in some sort of treasure protection program or something. Thrown in a cave to kill treasure hunters. A lot of this trip has reminded me of Indiana Jones. I'm not doing very Indiana Jonesy things, but I am so reminded of it. I like these trees, though. They're very craggly. You know, kind of creepy looking. Just, they just sort of grab out. They kind of like my hands. Oh, I'm wearing, I'm wearing koala mittens, by the way. I had to put on gloves. It's cold! And I'm wearing a coat, too. Oh, glad I brought it. Oh, another good view. So canyony, very grand. And we go this way. There are a bunch of other longer trails we could have gone on. This one's only like a fourth of a mile long. So it's half a mile round trip. It's not, it's not a long trail. Um, but I didn't want to be out here too long since I got here really late. Ooh, let's go, let's go that little way. I'm not sure you're supposed to, but we're gonna do it. Yeah. Up the rocks. Whoa! And there's stuff, foliage blocking that view, but I can have a better view of if I go down and over there again. Let's go this way. I know I'm, I'm not following the path. <laughs> Grace, 
You're gonna get lost. No. No, I won't. I won't get lost. It'll be fine. Now I'm going basically the same way as the path. It's, it's right down there. It's fine. Plus, I like climbing on rocks. It's fun. Oh, look at that rainstorm we keep walking closer to. Wonder if it's coming our direction. Maybe. Hopefully. Hopefully, no. I don't really want to get drenched in super cold rain. We can climb this. There's, I think the path is right over there. We'll be fine. It'll be okay. Cool. There's the path. It's right there. We're following it. It's fine. I hope that one little rock isn't holding up that giant rock because that would be entirely unstable and I would not trust it. But we have to get around this rock to get closer to the storm. You know, because that's, that's what we want to do. We want to get closer to the storm. There's something blue. See, I think someone else was up here. There's like skins of clementines up here or something. Whoa. Yeah, it looks like a big storm. Haven't seen any lightning yet, but it goes all the way over there. And then there's sun. And then there's storm. Two sides of the world. Oh, so nice over there. Oh well. Now we have to find our way back to the path. I don't recommend this path. That would be very disastrous for my health. So we're gonna go back this way, I think, if I can get over this rock. Just I only have one hand. The other one's holding the iPad. Oh, that'll be okay. That'll be fine. Oh, we got it. It's good. It's all good. Expert at climbing rocks. That's what I am. Such an expert. Because when you go down like this, you you do like the sit squat method. And then, you, then you jump and we don't go that way and go back the way we came. And jump. Ooh, did you hear that? That was thunder. Oh no! Can we go this way? I don't think we can go this way. We'll see. Neil? Well, we can go this way. It's like we'll shimmy along like we're Sly Cooper or something. It'll be good. Oh, we don't even have to shimmy. It's a great path. It's a, it's a good, good solid path. Ugh. Sort of. Kind of. It was good in theory. Oh, we'll just we'll just do the sit, sit and slide jump. There you go. Let's follow the trail again. Well, that was fun. I enjoyed that little rock climbing adventure. This path is supposed to take us to a really cool point, so I want to get to it, but <laughs> it's a little ominous looking. Ooh, I might get caught in the rain. Well. There's worse things, you know, like, yeah, yeah, it could be worse. A little water won't hurt me. Storm is definitely coming our way. Look how close it is now. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, well. I think we're almost to the point, so that'll be fine. It starts raining on me, I'll just turn around. I can outwalk a storm, right? Sure. Why not? Positive thinking. <laughs> I don't think it's happy to see me. <laughs> it's like, who dares disturb my slumber? Pulling some sort of Aladdin shit. Though there was a big, like, open hole in the sky with the sun shining through. Like, there were clouds. 
And then there was a hole in the clouds so the sun was shining through. I expected Mufasa's head to just sort of appear out of there. Give me some words of wisdom. There's people coming. <laughs> Hi. I can't be too crazy. There's other people out here. I'll be fine. Made it to the point. Apparently there's another trail that winds down there somewhere. I'm not sure where. But I'm not going down there now. Look at how close that storm is. Luck it. So it's raining now. <laughs> that storm caught up with me very quickly. Um, I didn't get poured on. It's it's not raining that hard, but some lightning did strike pretty close to it. Well, not close. It seemed close, you know, for lightning. A little freaky <laughs> being close to lightning out on a trail. Not that it was a very long trail, I made it back here very quickly, but... And now I get to drive... Um... Out of the Grand Canyon in the rain. So that'll, that'll be fun. We're not going to Zion today! <laughs> that was in the plan, but it didn't happen! That's okay. Maybe we'll catch it on our way back east. I don't know where I'm going tonight, though. Like after after now, I have, I have no idea where I'm going. Let's see. Let's pull out an atlas. I am here. Well, I have to go into Utah from here to go west. So. <laughs> that was scary thunder. It's a good thing I like thunderstorms and I'm not terrified of them. That'd be great. I just, I don't particularly, particularly like driving in them, but I like them in general. Well. <laughs> it's Haley. Because it's so cold. Well, it's time to get out of here. <laughs> yep. Yep, yep, yep. Turn that off. Okay. Definitely. Oh my god. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen. Um, I did not record anymore last night because it rained pretty much the whole way to the Walmart I'm staying at. Um, that hail was terrifying. Just so loud. But, um, yeah, it's about 10.30. We are in St. George, I believe. Utah. It's like right at the border of, uh, near the border of Utah and Arizona. I have a big thing of cranberry juice because I think I might have a bladder infection. Um, and this cured me the last time I had it, according to mom. Because <sighs> I'd really like to just cure it with cranberry juice and not it leaked on me! I'm not actually a huge fan of cranberry juice. It's not my favorite kind of juice. It's much better when it has vodka in it. No, the last time I had a bladder infection was when I was like 10 or something. 
I had to drink a ton of cranberry juice, but then it went away. So this is to hoping that I don't have to go to the doctor <laughs> and get some antibiotics while on my trip. So, so that's, that's my day so far. We're going to go to Las Vegas today. I just wanted to let you guys know I didn't die last night. So I'm using a subway straw to put it in my cranberry juice and then I tape the straw to the side. Oh, I did. Tape stopped working. Uh, got all juicy. Mm. Maybe I should just try to pour it into this water bottle. It might make a mess, but it'd be a lot easier to drink than with a straw. We're gonna try it. Let's see how it goes. That's a big opening. It'll be Mm. So much cranberry juice. I just, I love it. It's the best. It's Pagosa Springs water bottle. The visitor center gave it to me for free. I like Pagosa Springs. Probably one of the fav my favorite places I've visited so far. But, yeah. We're gonna go.